Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Uh, I'm down in one of our offices here and it's a little messy around us so don't mind that. Um, I, my mess is spread over multiple offices, this is just one of them. <laughs> but uh, So today's video is going to be a little bit different. Um, we're going to do some shout outs and talk about some upcoming videos. So uh, I was nominated by Gerald Farms to do four shout outs. Uh, I guess he was nominated and uh, he picked four people and each of those four people are asked to do shout outs as well. So I'm going to give you my four shout outs. Now, shout outs are a tough thing to do uh, on, on Facebook. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm talking about <laughs> on YouTube because, you know, like for me, I've, so to speak, met a lot of cool people on there. I watch, watch a lot of channels on a regular basis. so. It's hard to not offend anybody, you know, if you mention something. Um, you know, it's easy if somebody gives you a piece of advice or uh, sets you up with a part that you need or something, but, you know, when you're doing something as general as just shouting out some channels, sometimes, uh, you know, it, it can be difficult. And again, you know, you don't want to offend anybody. So, what I did. Uh, I'm going to show you a couple different things here, but I'm going to sh first show you my four uh, shout outs that I'm going to do. And if you guys happen to see these, these channels now, I'm asking you, you got to do your four shout outs too. So the criteria for me uh, when picking my shout outs was I tried to limit the number of subscribers to about a thousand. So if you have more than a thousand subscribers, um, I, I didn't shout you out because honestly, you guys are, are well on your way. What I tried to do was pick people that, like I said, the threshold was about a thousand or less, just to try and help some of the smaller channels like myself. I mean, I'm, I'm only about 600 right now. So um, again, we're, we're trying to build our channel and trying to put some work into it. So um, again, I just, I picked uh, channels that have have under under the thousand so without further ado I will show you my channels all right so hopefully you can see this okay so the first channel I chose uh, the gentleman goes by the name of Cody Jubb and uh, he is not a regular poster on YouTube uh, you can see there the last video he put was three months ago but he does some uh, quite a few hay videos some repair videos things like that um, and you know he's only got 121 subscribers and part of that might be that he just doesn't post on a regular basis but um, one of the cool things about this channel I found out because he commented on one of my videos he is actually right over the mountain from me so he's only about four miles away from me so I thought that was really cool um, you know what a small world it is to find another youtuber that close to you there's a lot of other YouTube channels in Pennsylvania that I've watched or found, uh, but none that I are as close as him. So that's the first one I'm shouting out. Uh, check out his channel. If you like what you see, please hit the subscribe button for him and uh, help him grow his channel a little bit. So the next channel was one that I found recently called Back Farms. He only has 492 subscribers really a lot of cool content on here um i have started watching some of the older videos you know kind of getting caught up on some of the stuff he's done in the past and um there's just a lot of cool stuff on here some equipment stuff um some repair videos just a lot of neat stuff so uh, check out his channel as well the third one i've been watching a little bit longer they're called Back to the Land Organic Farmers. Uh, they are up in New York State. I'm in Pennsylvania for those of you who aren't aware of that. Uh, I think they're, I don't know exactly where they are, but I think they are about two hours north of me, uh, give or take. So they're, they're fairly close by. They're kind of a husband and wife team that uh, do kind of what they say there, organic farming. They milk some cows. But uh, let's see, they have um, an International M on there. They do some equipment videos. They uh, show some with the cows and you know, you can see one there with the pigs and stuff. So really, really nice people, uh, just down to earth type people. 
you know, you can ask them some questions, you know, leave some comments, whatever, and just, just really, really nice down to earth people. And it's pretty cool too, to watch some of the um, things, the way that they farm is a little bit different than what you traditionally see. And that's not just because of the organic portion of it. Uh, they also do things just kind of on a smaller, simpler scale. And I think a lot of times we could learn something uh, from, from those types of operations. So that's pretty cool. So check that out. And the last one just barely made the cutoff here. He has just over a thousand subscribers. I think he just hit the thousand subscriber mark not too long ago there. Um, but uh, Denny's Country Life. Uh, I've been watching him for uh, quite a while now. I don't usually miss a video that he does. He does some hay stuff, as you can see on top. He's got some beefers, a few horses. He does some fabricating. Um, he recently got this uh, New Holland tractor. He did a review on that. Um, so he's got some good content on there. Uh, one of the cool things about his channel for me is again seeing the different way that people do things he is on the other side of the country from me he is on the west coast so things are a little bit different um you know the weather patterns environment just everything's a little bit different out there so that's kind of neat for me to see um how things progress throughout the year but yeah cool stuff on there so check that channel out um so here is my channel 596 uh subscribers we're getting there it's been a uh, slow journey, but I'm trying. So what I'm, what I'm going to do on here, um, if you guys want to see some of the other channels that I watch on a regular basis, a lot of them are over here on the side. They're not all here because the list, you have to sit there and scroll for quite a while. So what I'm going to do is sort of swap some of these out every so often. So if you want to... Okay my memory card was full there so there's going to be a weird glitch in this video so what i was saying before that happened was there's a lot of cool channels i watch i can't fit them all on here so if you want to see some of the other channels that i watch that have you know more than a thousand subscribers here's a nice list of them i will switch them out every so often with uh, either some newer ones that i find or whatever um, just to kind of keep it rotated through fresh so again check some of those out but um so yeah that's um that is my four shout outs so check those channels out all right and as for upcoming videos uh we're gonna have an upcoming video on some new uh snow removal equipment and things that we bought there's some stuff out here in the garage that i'd like to show you guys there's going to be an update video on my 06 uh, GMC Duramax truck. Had some stuff done to that, so we're going to do an update video on that. I bought another, uh, call it a piece of equipment. Uh, we're going to do a video on that, me going to pick that up. And uh, what else? There's some other stuff coming up too. So there's a lot of cool videos coming up. So stay tuned for those. If you are not subscribed, click that button for me, please. If you click the little bell icon, then that helps me out. Make sure that you guys see the videos that they'll pop up for you and whatnot. And don't forget to leave a comment. I like comments and I love reading them, uh, answering everybody back. So make sure you leave a comment down below and I will catch everybody on the next video. As always, thanks for watching.